Hey, how you doing? Good morning. Welcome to Side Dish. I'm Marilyn Russell. This is Andrea, my kitten girl. <laughs> Are we revealing your last name on this? No. Okay. And I'll tell you why when we get to it. All right. Mm -hmm. You have a good reason, I'm sure. I do. No doubt. It's part All of right. our topic today. It's Side Dish, and the question I have for Andrea and everyone out there on the Ustream, did I do something incredibly stupid Saturday night? Did you see my tweet? Yes, I saw that tweet. I've been worried about you. I took a lot like of heat. Two days. I took heat for the tweet. Yes. What I I tweeted here, I I sent out a tweet about where I was going to be Saturday because you're in my Facebook and a couple of other friends and I thought a couple thousand people. <laughs> well, I thought if no, if know. you don't have something to do, maybe you'd come find me and hang out where I was, having a great time. So what did I do wrong? Everyone's giving me crap. Well, you tweeted to a thousand strangers that you didn't know where you would be. They're not and all strangers. Some no, they're not all my, strangers, but some of them are. Some of them are my real friends. Some Facebook. of them are your in real life friends. You know who friends. you are. But like Perez Hilton does, who is also on Ben, when he wants to go out, he'll tweet, hey, going out tonight, I'm in this city. If you know me in real life, direct message me and I'll tell you the details. So he, and that's the way of mass getting the people that follow you without, you know, but what if there is a psycho who's stalking you, who comes, who goes, oh, she's getting drunk at this bar tonight. And what? <laughs> and you go out in your neighborhood, right? I go out in my neighborhood. I don't want strangers it was a to bar. know. Yeah, you don't want strangers to know but I don't have where str you are. But I don't have strangers on my Facebook. Not really. Not a single one. Not a single well, person. I you know, know all those people in real life, you're very popular. But wait, per Perez, okay, no. Some of them are just, thankfully, they listen to Ben FM, and so they know me from the station. And I love that they're on my Facebook. So what? You're telling me Perez Hilton goes through all his direct messages to see if anybody wants to know where he is? Well, yeah. <laughs> I'm not doing that. It, it takes too... What? what? That's, I just you know what doesn't take too long? Time. Getting knifed by a crazy person. So you think it was a bad move, too? It was um, not the best move. Because, I mean, we usually tweet about where we're going to be if it's a station appearance. And hey, I'm here at this time, but also you have the entire Ben crew with you. But I had a whole crew with me too. It was it was the entourage. It wasn't just me. I don't go by myself to bars. That's that what it sounded dangerous. like. That's what it sounded like. I should have said me and my girl. Marilyn's alone at the bar. <laughs> Come and knife her. Oh my god. All right, well I'm a loser. I need lessons in tweeting, so there's that. It's like putting a billboard on I ninety five. You haven't done that? <laughs> Oops, yeah. I guess I shouldn't have done that either. Yeah, it's, the, <laughs> it's like getting the digital billboard that Ben has and putting Marilyn is at such and such bar drinking Miller Lite. Yeah, but I'm always somewhere <laughs> doing something, whether I'm with the station or by, on my own. Somebody can find me. But with your specific tweet, you were inviting people to your neighborhood, which also I don't do either. I mean, if you notice, I don't use my friends' names and I don't mention the bars that we go to when I talk because... And I don't even say my last name all of the time because you're worried. I don't have bars on my windows and I live all by myself. Although, stalkers, I have a big scary dog. <laughs> I have a big scary dog too. I have a pretty so. big scary dog. I, I really do though. I have a huge big scary dog who's super uber protective of me. So there. And you have an 18 year old son who can kick ass. Kick black belt. Well, I don't have those dog. things. Yeah. So as a single person. I have wing men, wing alone, women, wing people. I see that text and I think, ooh, red flag. Well, you missed a good time. You should have come out. So the question is, if someone from my Facebook circle did come out and he was a dude, was he just thinking, oh, she's wasted. I'm going to go make my move right now? That would be what I would <laughs> assume. All That's right. what I assume. I'm, I, again, I'm a big to fat loser. Thanks for pointing out. Be paranoid. <laughs> or maybe I'm paranoid. Yeah. Who knows? Just we, need, a, we need a vote. Yeah, we need help. We need a balance between super paranoid and two-way open accessible. Paranoid or street savvy. Or cautious. Accessible or Stupid. crazy. <laughs> you make the call. You decide. <laughs> America. <laughs> All right, anyway, here it is. We'll take your comments right in that section right under there. Below us on the website, I like benefem.com. Thanks for listening to The Side Dish. She's Andrea. I'm Marilyn, and we're silly.